the 2022 FIFA World Cup will be held in Qatar in November and December this year. Due to excessive heat, the biggest sporting event in the world will be held in autumn for the first time. Now, why is Qatar a controversial location and why FIFA has asked the World Cup teams and fans to be mindful? The FIFA tournament is a spectacle that turns the host countries into a non-stop party, but that may not be the case this year in Qatar. In Qatar, alcohol is only available at restaurants and bars that have licenses. Non-Muslim residents can have alcohol in their house if they have a license. Public drunkenness is punishable, a person can be fined or even jailed for it. At the World Cup, fans will be allowed to buy beers only within the stadium compound before and after the game. Fans can also drink in the evenings only at designated fan zones. Qatar is one of the most restrictive countries when it comes to drugs. It prohibits cannabis and any kind of over-the-counter medications like narcotics. The sale, trafficking or even having a drug is illegal, which may lead to severe penalties, prison sentences or sometimes even deportation. World Cup fans have to be aware because the authorities may scan the bags or even the passengers with a very new technology which can identify the smallest quantities of drugs. Qatar considers sexual relationship between unmarried men and women a crime. Homosexuality is illegal in the country. According to Qatari laws, if adults are seen having consensual gay or lesbian sex, then they can be jailed for one to three years. Cross dressing is also a crime in Qatar. Some soccer players have raised concerns about the fans who are traveling from another country, especially the LGBTQIA community. However, the authorities say that unmarried couples can stay in the same room without any issue. The government tourism website says that the tourists should avoid showing intimacy in public. Qatar government's tourism website urges men and women to show respect to the local culture. Those in shorts or sleeveless tops may be turned away from public buildings and malls. Other offenses include flashing the middle finger or swearing especially against the police authorities, filming and photographing people without their consent, and insulting the royal families. All these may result in prosecution. There are other controversies regarding the allegations from the US Department of Justice that bribes were paid to secure votes while giving the voting rights for the tournament. But the organizers of the World Cup 2022 tournament have strongly denied it. And also, Qatar has faced intense criticism over human rights groups for their treatment on migrant workers.